All right, it's another beautiful morning here at Castaway Key, day two, second stop of Castaway Key. We're excited. Diane is feeling much better. Hello, Miss Diane. <laughs> it is early in the morning and we are just pulling into the port here, the dock. Backing in. There's backing in. Yeah, they back into most of them, I think. And, uh, and so there's some activity abuzz on the island already, but really most of what happens on the island gets taken off the ship, the crew from the ship just starts populating the island with all the restaurants. They pull all the food off of there. There are some local Bahamian um, folks that have, uh, they boat in from other locations and uh, they work on the island as well. And there's, yeah, there's uh, Disney American workers that um, stay on the island, but they have to pull out at night. We couldn't just stay in the port um, docked overnight because apparently there are big bug issues on the island. There also might be, I mean, even though this is Disney's private island, it is still owned and operated by the Bahamian government. There are regulations. I don't know that cruise ships can, can port overnight. I mean, I, we don't know all the rules and reasons, but we've heard over the years that it's just really buggy. <laughs> you can see them getting all the provisions off for the meals in it in shops today lots of busyness before they let us off the ship it's been a lot of years since we had mickey ketchup they used to do that for our daughter all the time but diane for her breakfast got some hash browns and wanted some ketchup and this is how they presented it it's so funny that's because they can tell i'm not a grown-up yeah <laughs> All right, Diane has her scooter and she's ready to go. Well, I found my spot. How about you, Diane? <laughs> she, she's gonna go float in the water. Okay, here is my finished painting. kind of fun. Never done anything like this before, but it fills the mood.
Hello, Dumbo. Each of the ships has a different character on the back. I think the most fun is the one tangled because her hair is wrapped all over hanging from the different railings. But they're all, they're all special. Well, if you're wondering if your mountaineering skills have transferable uses, here's one right here. <laughs> Painting the side of a ship. Look at that. That's pretty awesome. It's pirate night on the cruise ship. Every cruise ship has a uh, pirate night and fireworks and it's pretty fun. But what I'm also excited about is we just got out of seeing Indiana Jones. And one of the cool things about Disney Cruise Line is they show first run movies. They, they own all the movies, right? All the good ones at least. And so we just got out of seeing Indiana Jones. It was so fun. So we're on to continue our celebration tonight. I'll bring you some fireworks. A few other pirates we'll see around the ship and it'll be a good night. Now arriving, 
please give a big Disney fantasy welcome to the new captain of this year's ship. All the way from Neverland, it's Captain Hook! Yes, it is I, the new caretaker and overseer of this fine vessel. <laughs> Simply put, this ship is mine! Me. Status report. Aye, Captain. All loose ends are tied up, so to speak. <laughs> the ship is now yours to do with as she please. Enjoy. Oh, I shall. What's the matter, former Captain? <laughs> you can't touch your tongue. <laughs> now, listen here, Hook. You may have the upper hand, but I'm not uh, oh, <laughs> but this is our ship, and I intend to get it back with a captain's challenge. Blast <laughs> that pirate crew! Oh, very well. But we test this so-called pirate crew. Just one easy, easy, wrong answer, and he wants the flag. All right, Captain Hook, look behind me, swabs. Now the first. All right, we're back in Animator's Palette and uh it's pirate night so all the restaurants have the same menu it's a pirate themed food it's a lot of indian and caribbean spicy foods um so it should be good diane wasn't entirely certain though that it would be good she's like because eh. we've had this menu before right we've done pirate uh, yeah. nights and yeah it's pretty similar so but we'll see it came with um, a cornbread that they called Johnny Cake and this mango puree with which spices, was which very was good. very good to put on that. All right. So Len is, guess who? This is his go-to costume. Let's, yeah. let's be frank. It is the most comfortable outfit he wears the entire cruise. And yeah. people just howl when they see him. <laughs> Well, I like, come by it naturally. I have the big belly and yeah, the white no, beard. Yeah, no, you look like me, so it totally works. But it was kind of funny that there's a guy on the ship who's dressed as an alligator. He's like, you yeah. want to hang out all night? So, yeah. yeah. Alligator with the big clock. Yep. So, if you are planning on taking a Disney cruise, be aware that Pirate Night happens. They don't make a big deal about it, like, on the website or anything. You just got to know it's that it part happens. Of the culture. It's part of the culture. Yeah. And I'm not even going to lie, people take this very seriously. Yeah. Some of these moms go into full production mode. The entire family is in full costume, matchy matchy, all the way down to the baby. You name it. Like, it is a big deal. Big, big, big deal. So. <laughs> Just get your little creativity going. Start to look at your family. Like, Len's a natural. He fit Schmied. I couldn't figure out any character to go with Schmied, so I don't. I didn't do a character at all. I have a pirate costume that is incredibly uncomfortable, so I've got to, like, figure out a really comfortable one like Len's. But, yeah. You, yeah. Like, get to work. If you are coming on a Disney cruise working on your pirate outfits for everyone and the hardest one is going to be your husband because usually the boys don't like to dress up like we do oh no the boys love the pirates what are you talking about yeah well the yeah the pirates the kind of patches. one of the less yeah yeah no the boys enjoy it yeah so be creative yeah uh sometimes it just takes a pair of scissors and cutting up some of the clothes they already have yeah don't go and buy crazy costumes oh but some girls, it's, Some people it's have. buying the corsets yeah. and the the boots and the, yeah, no, it, there's a thing, yeah. yeah. So, yeah, it's a big deal. And your kids will love it. Um, we were just talking about the show we just watched, that it, it really kind of struck me for the first time that, like, they're kind of encouraging the kids to be naughty little, you know, pirates and that this is the happy life and that's the right life to choose which yo, i was like yo ho yo ho a pirate's life for me well that's 
that's the <laughs> the completely vanilla ice cream version. Well, but the little song in this last show was yeah. a little. Hmm, I don't know. The words were a little questionable. So I guess I'm just one of those moms now. Yeah. But yeah, pirates. I, I yeah, think you're Pinterest. Tired of looking at me. <laughs> Who could be tired, tired of, of looking, looking at, at you? <laughs> Who could be tired? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're back for the fireworks show tonight. The Pirates in the Caribbean party. Can we have fireworks every night of our, of our lives? Because it seems like that's what we do. Yeah. It would be nice. Huh? So, we do. this is probably similar to the one we were at earlier, but that was designed more for little kids. The stage has changed and it's much more dark and and then of course the fireworks. But they did a full set change. Which yeah, yeah, I'll show you I'll show you in just a minute. Wow. So um, we've done these obviously for years. We've done a lot of uh, these uh, cruises with the pirate night and but fireworks. They seem, to, seem to alter it a they, little bit they all the time. They change it, they change it up, yeah. it's pretty cool. I I think I'm pretty sure they're still the only cruise line that does fireworks at sea. If so, not, tell them about it in the comments section. Uh, yeah, actually, correct me if I'm wrong. Them, yeah. I know for years they were. Maybe that's they were changed. the ones that initiated fireworks at sea. Yeah, like, they'll hold on to that forever. Yeah, absolutely. So let me show you the new sets. So it's all darker, and of course we're at night too. And the fireworks will go off up there. There we go. You come seeking adventure and saw the old pirates, eh? Well, you come to the proper place. Tonight, you be traveling in mysterious waters. Waters once owned by tales of plenty of pirates and the ones who hunted them. Some say when the night is right, and the sea is willing. These scoundrels will once again save the seas. <laughs> Fire! Ahoy, mateys, and welcome aboard! Where be my pirates? <laughs> if everyone be worth their salt and faithful before the mast, say I! <laughs> well, I heard you had a Yo, 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 
lies ahead. Here's luck and a fair wind to you. And remember, dead men tell no tales. <laughs> hey, well, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed our day on the cruise with the pirate night and all the fireworks. And if you would, go ahead and like and subscribe. We'd appreciate that. Hit that thumbs up. It really helps our channel, and we so appreciate it. Be good to others. Bye-bye.